Hey guys, in this video, we're going to talk about how you can make money by listening to music on Spotify. It doesn't matter where in the world you're from, whether you're from Europe, Asia, Africa, Australia, and the US, beginners from all over the world have been making money using this strategy. And trust me when I say that you can do it too. And so if getting paid for listening to music sounds good to you, then keep on watching. Welcome to Next Level Finance, where we teach you how to make money online with your financial freedom as the ultimate goal. To get you excited, let me show you just how much this particular site I'll be telling you about in a minute is paying people just to listen to music. You can get anywhere from 200 all the way to 800 pounds, which is around 1100 in US dollars just by doing something you're already doing anyway, which is listen to music. There are also some testimonials here, as you can see, that will show you how people from all over the world are really doing this and making big money out of it. Not a lot of people know about this site yet, so you can definitely use this to your advantage. And before this video ends, I'll be sharing a secret strategy with you which will boost your earnings and allow you to make even more money than your competitors do on this website. This will only work if you follow all of the tips and tricks that I will share with you today, so do make sure you stick around for the entire video. So the very first thing you'll need is a Spotify account, and if you don't already have one, you can download it easily on the Apple or Play Store and then just link it to your Facebook account. Once you have your Spotify account ready, you can go ahead and do step one for this money-making strategy and create playlists. It's fun and simple, and even if you've never made one before, it's easy enough to start. You just click on the Create Playlist button on the left, give it a title, and start adding songs on the list. Which then brings us to the next thing we'll need to get this strategy to work. And this is the website that I mentioned earlier that not a lot of people know about yet. So the site actually allows you to sign up as a music curator for free. And like I said before, you can get paid simply by listening to music. So again, this is how it's going to work. You listen to music on Spotify, curate them, categorize the songs into playlists, and then submit them to this website. And let me reveal its name right now. It's called musicgateway.com. And I think I'm going to take you there right now. Music Gateway is a space where music curators can make money online by spending their time listening to music. And while that may sound like the perfect job, there's a little more to it than that. Don't worry, I promise it's still very simple and something that even beginners can do. So besides listening to music, it, it says on the Music Gateway website that a curator will listen to and categorize music from labels and independent artists, often receiving hundreds of applications in a day. They will categorize them by genre, feel, instrumentation, male or female vocals, and anything else that you can think of. The more specific the categorization, the easier it makes a music curator's job. As you may already have guessed, you will get paid based on the number of listens that your playlist gets. So because of this, the more playlists that you create, the more listens you will probably get too, right? And because that's where the money is, that's exactly what I want to show you how to do step by step. So let's get to that right now. So let's go back to Spotify. How do you create a playlist that will get you the most listens? Since we already know that the more listens your playlist gets, the more money you can make from it, we want to know what people like. Of course, there are many genres and kinds of music out there. So what you enjoy may not necessarily be what other people search for or listen to. So if you create a playlist based on your personal preference, well, you're probably not going to be able to maximize your earnings. To maximize your earnings, you'll need to do quick basic research with the help of our reliable friend Google. Simply type in best pop song September 2021, best rock song, best alternative songs, um, on the Google search bar, and as you can see, you'll automatically get around 50 to 100 songs over here. So, like right now, I can see Good For You by Olivia Rodrigo, Kiss Me More by Dojo Cat, Montero by Lil Nas, Peaches by Justin Bieber, Save Your Tears, Ariana Grande, etc, etc. All these songs are topping the charts right now, and these are what people are looking for and listening to. 
Performing this one simple step makes your job so much easier because you can create a playlist out of these search results already. So on Spotify, simply add all of these songs and name your playlist whatever you want, as long as it gives people a clear idea of what kind of music is in it. So let's do that right now. Okay, I want to add Olivia Rodrigo's Good For You. I want to add Peaches by Justin Bieber. Let me add Kiss Me More by Dojo Cat. Save Your Tears by Ariana Grande. And when I'm done, I can name my playlist. Uh, let's see. Okay, I want to name it Pop Chart Toppers 2021. Okay, as you're doing this, you'll also notice that Spotify will show you a list of recommended songs based on the ones that are already on your playlist. So you can go ahead and click on those two if you want. And after that, you can even break this list down into smaller playlists. For example, Best Female Pop Songs 2021, Best Male Pop Songs 2021, or also by Mood, Upbeat Pop Songs 2021, Slow Jams Pop 2021, etc. You get the picture, right? Don't worry, you'll get the whole list of recommended songs to add for each of the playlists that you can create so that will make your job even easier to do. Okay, even beginners can do this, I promise. So I want you to do this for all the genres and categories that you can think of just so you can get as many playlists as you can right away. Now that you have your playlist, well, you can sit around and wait for people to start listening so you can start earning. Then again, there's another thing that you can do, and it's to help things along by letting people know about the awesome playlists that you've curated for them. And here's the bonus tip that I promised I would share with you. Instead of just posting your playlist directly on musicgateway.com, which you can do, I think it would be best if you took this one extra step to ensure that you maximize the number of listens that your playlist gets. And you can achieve that with the help of this website called soundplay.com. Don't worry, this website is also 100% free to use. And what it does is basically help you promote your curated playlists on the internet. So besides Soundplate, there's also this other platform that's very similar. It's called TuneMonk.com and it also does help you gain more playlist followers and connect with playlist creators. So on its website, you'll see that there are also some tips on how to become a better music creator. So do explore that site when you get the chance and you can maximize that free resource. So again, just sign up for a free account and promote your playlist links to help them receive as much traction as possible. And there you have it. That's basically how you can make money doing the simple task of listening to music and sorting them into categories. If you found value in today's content, please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, or share links with your friends because it really supports our channel. We have a ton of other videos that you can binge watch and learn from, so make sure to check those out too. I'll leave links in the description box below. If you have any questions, comments, suggestions, do leave them down as well. And well, that's it for now. Alrighty then, signing off until the next one.